In the world of medicine, there are few substances as remarkable as sulfasalazine. This revolutionary drug has proven to be a true miracle for individuals suffering from inflammatory conditions, offering relief and hope where none seemed possible before. Whether it's rheumatoid arthritis, ulcerative colitis, or even Crohn's disease, sulfasalazine has emerged as a powerful weapon in the fight against these debilitating conditions. But what makes this drug so special? Sulfasalazine works by targeting the root cause of inflammation, effectively reducing pain, swelling, and stiffness in affected areas. With its proven track record of success and minimal side effects, it's no wonder that sulfasalazine has become a go-to treatment option for countless patients and healthcare professionals alike. In this article, we'll delve deeper into the science behind this wonder drug, explore its various applications, and shed light on the life-changing benefits it can bring to those in need. Get ready to discover the incredible healing powers of sulfasalazine and how it has transformed the lives of so many individuals around the world. Understanding Inflammatory Conditions Inflammatory conditions are a group of disorders characterized by chronic inflammation, which occurs when the body's immune system mistakenly attacks its own tissues. This immune response leads to pain, swelling, and tissue damage. Conditions such as rheumatoid arthritis, ulcerative colitis, and Crohn's disease fall under this category. Rheumatoid arthritis is an autoimmune disease that primarily affects the joints, causing pain, stiffness, and swelling. Ulcerative colitis and Crohn's disease are both types of inflammatory bowel disease IBD, that affect the digestive tract, leading to symptoms such as abdominal pain, diarrhea, and rectal bleeding. These conditions can have a significant impact on a person's quality of life, making even simple daily activities a challenge. That's where sulfasalazine comes in. How sulfasalazine works. Sulfasalazine is a combination drug that consists of two active components, sulfapyridine and mesalazine. Sulfapyridine is an antibiotic that targets bacteria in the gut, while mesalazine is an anti-inflammatory agent. Together, these components work synergistically to combat inflammation and relieve symptoms associated with various inflammatory conditions. When sulfasalazine is ingested, it is broken down in the colon by bacteria into sulfapyridine and mesalazine. Sulfapyridine acts locally in the gut, where it reduces the concentration of harmful bacteria that can trigger inflammation. Mesalazine, on the other hand, is absorbed into the bloodstream and distributed throughout the body, targeting inflammation in other areas, such as the joints or the digestive tract. The exact mechanisms by which sulfasalazine exerts its anti-inflammatory effects are not fully understood. However, it is believed that mesalazine inhibits the production of certain inflammatory chemicals in the body, such as prostaglandins and leukotrienes. By reducing the levels of these chemicals, sulfasalazine helps to alleviate pain, swelling, and stiffness associated with inflammatory conditions. Common Uses of Sulfasalazine Sulfasalazine has a wide range of applications and is commonly prescribed for the treatment of rheumatoid arthritis, ulcerative colitis, and Crohn's disease. Let's explore each of these conditions in more detail. Rheumatoid Arthritis Rheumatoid arthritis is a chronic autoimmune disease that primarily affects the joints. It causes inflammation, pain, and swelling, which can lead to joint deformity and disability if left untreated. Sulfasalazine is often prescribed as a first-line treatment for rheumatoid arthritis, either as a standalone therapy or in combination with other disease-modifying anti-rheumatic drugs DMARDs. It helps to reduce joint inflammation, alleviate pain, and slow down the progression of the disease. Ulcerative colitis Ulcerative colitis is an inflammatory bowel disease characterized by inflammation and ulcers in the lining of the colon and rectum. It can cause symptoms such as abdominal pain, diarrhea, rectal bleeding, and weight loss. Sulfasalazine is commonly used to induce and maintain remission in patients with mild to moderate ulcerative colitis. It helps to reduce inflammation in the colon and alleviate symptoms, improving the quality of life for those affected by this condition. Crohn's disease Crohn's disease is another form of inflammatory bowel disease that can affect any part of the digestive tract, from the mouth to the anus. It causes inflammation, pain, diarrhea, and weight loss, among other symptoms. Sulfasalazine is sometimes prescribed as a treatment option for mild to moderate Crohn's disease, particularly when the disease is limited to the colon or the lower part of the small intestine. It helps to reduce inflammation in the affected areas and improve symptoms. Benefits and Effectiveness of Sulfasalazine one of the key benefits of sulfasalazine is its effectiveness in reducing inflammation and alleviating symptoms associated with various inflammatory conditions. Numerous studies have shown its efficacy in treating rheumatoid arthritis, ulcerative colitis, and Crohn's disease. 
In rheumatoid arthritis, sulfasalazine has been shown to improve joint pain, reduce swelling, and slow down the progression of joint damage. It has also been found to improve physical function and quality of life in patients with this condition. For ulcerative colitis, sulfasalazine has been shown to induce and maintain remission in a significant number of patients. It helps to reduce abdominal pain, diarrhea, and rectal bleeding, allowing individuals to regain control over their lives. In Crohn's disease, sulfasalazine has been found to be effective in reducing inflammation and improving symptoms, particularly in patients with mild to moderate disease that is limited to the colon or the lower part of the small intestine. Another benefit of sulfasalazine is its relatively low cost compared to some other treatment options for inflammatory conditions. This makes it accessible to a broader range of patients, particularly in countries with limited healthcare resources. Side Effects and Precautions like any medication, sulfasalazine can cause side effects. The most common side effects include nausea, vomiting, loss of appetite, headache, and rash. These side effects are usually mild and temporary, and they can often be minimized by taking the medication with food or by starting with a low dose and gradually increasing it. In rare cases, sulfasalazine can cause more serious side effects, such as liver or kidney problems, blood disorders, and allergic reactions. It is important to discuss any concerns or pre-existing medical conditions with your healthcare provider before starting sulfasalazine. Sulfasalazine should not be taken by individuals with a known allergy to sulfonamides, as it can trigger an allergic reaction. It should also be used with caution in individuals with a history of blood disorders or liver or kidney disease. Dosage and administration of sulfasalazine. The dosage of sulfasalazine can vary depending on the specific condition being treated and the individual patient. It is typically started at a low dose and gradually increased to the therapeutic dose over several weeks. For rheumatoid arthritis, the usual starting dose is 500 mg once or twice daily, which can be increased to a maintenance dose of 2 to 3 grams per day. For ulcerative colitis, the initial dose is usually 1 to 2 grams per day, which can be increased to a maintenance dose of 3 to 4 grams per day. For Crohn's disease, the recommended dose is 3 to 4 grams per day. Sulfasalazine is available in tablet form and should be taken with a full glass of water. It is important to follow the prescribed dosage and frequency as directed by your healthcare provider. Alternatives to Sulfasalazine While sulfasalazine is highly effective for many individuals, it may not be suitable for everyone or may not provide optimal relief of symptoms. In such cases, there are alternative treatment options available. For rheumatoid arthritis, other disease-modifying anti-rheumatic drugs, DMARDs, such as methotrexate, leflunamide, or biologic agents may be considered. These medications work in different ways to reduce inflammation and slow down the progression of the disease. For ulcerative colitis and Crohn's disease, other medications such as corticosteroids, immunomodulators, or biologic agents may be prescribed, depending on the severity and location of the disease. It is important to consult with your healthcare provider to determine the most appropriate treatment option for your specific condition. Frequently asked questions about sulfasalazine. 1. Can sulfasalazine be used during pregnancy? Sulfasalazine should be used with caution during pregnancy, particularly during the first trimester. It has been associated with a slightly increased risk of certain birth defects. However, the decision to use sulfasalazine during pregnancy should be made on a case-by-case -case basis, weighing the potential benefits against the risks. 2. Can sulfasalazine be used in children? Sulfasalazine can be used in children, but the dosage and duration of treatment may be different compared to adults. It is important to consult with a pediatrician or a healthcare provider experienced in treating pediatric inflammatory conditions for appropriate dosing and monitoring. 3. How long does it take for sulfasalazine to work? The onset of action of sulfasalazine can vary depending on the condition being treated and the individual patient. In some cases, it may take several weeks to months before the full benefits of the medication are realized. It is important to be patient and consistent with the prescribed treatment plan. 4. Can sulfasalazine be taken with other medications? Sulfasalazine can interact with certain medications, so it is important to inform your healthcare provider about all the medications, supplements, or herbal products you are taking. This includes over-the-counter medications. Your healthcare provider can assess potential interactions and adjust your treatment plan accordingly. Conclusion: Is sulfasalazine right for you? Sulfasalazine is undeniably a remarkable drug that has transformed the lives of countless individuals suffering from inflammatory conditions. 
Its ability to target the root cause of inflammation and alleviate pain, swelling, and stiffness has made it a go-to treatment option for rheumatoid arthritis, ulcerative colitis, and Crohn's disease. However, as with any medication, it is important to weigh the benefits against the potential risks and consider individual factors such as medical history, allergies, and other medications being taken. It is essential to have an open and honest conversation with your healthcare provider to determine if sulfasalazine is the right choice for you. Remember, sulfasalazine is just one piece of the puzzle in managing inflammatory conditions. It is often used in combination with other treatments, such as physical therapy, lifestyle modifications, and other medications, to provide optimal relief and improve overall quality of life. If you are currently struggling with an inflammatory condition, do not lose hope. Talk to your healthcare provider about sulfasalazine and other treatment options that may be suitable for your specific needs. With the right treatment plan, you can regain control of your life and experience the transformative effects of this miracle drug. Thanks for watching.